Hey guys, today's video is going to be a haul. I had my last sourcing trip. I feel like I said this on my last haul video, but for sure, yesterday was our last sourcing trip before baby gets here because I'm currently 37 weeks and five days and I'm being induced at 39 weeks. Praying to come sooner though. Um, but yeah, last yesterday was definitely our last sourcing trip. I wanted to show you guys some of the things that I got from that trip. I found some brands that are new to me and I'm excited about. Um, so yeah, if I sound congested in this video, it's because I am. Oh my gosh. First of all, my mom was sick. She got tested for COVID, COVID negative, thank God. But she had all the symptoms, you know, like congested, like just all the cold and slash COVID symptoms because they're, you know, kind of the same, right? COVID's just like the flu, guys, right? Come on, come on. So anyway, she got tested. She's negative. Um, yesterday, Brady and Sorrel both had a runny nose and then I woke up today and I'm just like all congested and just gross feeling. So trying to film some videos. I have like 15 videos pre-filmed, like no joke, but I don't know. I feel like that's not enough. I'm just like pushing myself to do more. And you guys are so sweet. I've gotten so many comments on like recent videos saying like, Vanessa, you need to relax. You know, we're going to understand if you can't upload videos, you know, we understand. Um, so you guys are awesome by the way. Okay. On to the haul. So again, I found some brands that are new to me, um, but majority of this stuff is like bread and butter stuff, stuff that I usually find First off, I want to show you some things that I'm keeping. I found these joggers. They're just old navy. They're the breathe on joggers, but I don't know. I like the color and these will be so good to wear postpartum. Well, like now too and postpartum, um, but they're just lightweight joggers and I don't know. I really like the color. These were like $2. So I'm like, okay, I'm getting them cute. Um, I got these Nike sweatpants. I might keep these for myself. Um, all of this stuff is listed aside from these. I haven't decided if I'm keeping them for myself, um, but these are just Nike sweatpants. And again, I like the color. It's like an oatmeal, like mauve -y color. Like, I don't know. But again, something perfect to wear postpartum. They're like wide leg, comfortable and really, really, really good condition. So yeah, I think I just might keep those. Okay, the first brand that I found that I've never found before and I was excited because it's on my bolo list is Beta Brand. Um, so these are the dress pant yoga pants. I actually have two pairs of these. The other one's across the room, um, but they're both the same size. One is uh, new with tags. The other one is new without tags. This one doesn't have the tags on it. The tag, it says medium petite, but I put measurements and listed them as a medium because I think the waist is... Um, if I remember correctly, the waist is 28 and the length was 28. So I'm like, it's not really, it's not really petite. I don't know if I put measurements, I feel comfortable, you know, like changing the size to better search results, you know, if that makes sense. Cause I'm not like scamming anyone. I'm telling you like these are the measurements and I'm showing a picture of the actual size tag. So anyway, this is what they look like. Um, dress pant yoga pants. So they're dress pants, but they're super stretchy and comfortable like yoga pants. So they have like faux pockets here. They do have real pockets. Oh, they don't. I thought they had real pockets on the back. <gasps> they don't. Okay. These are the boot cut ones. Hi, baby. Again, I have two pairs of these. They're both petite mediums. And next thing that I found are these Athleta pants. These are called the two-in-one exhale pants. And they're size small, but they're so cute. It's a skirt over like leggings. I sold a pair like this. I don't think it was from Athleta. Actually, I don't remember the brand. I sold within hours. Um, so yeah, we'll see how these go. Um, size small, but yeah, super cute. Got some pink Victoria's Secret joggers. These are extra small. I got these because of the sequins on the sides and they're, it's in, yeah, they're in really good condition. Look like that, extra small. Um, these are probably fit a small though. The waist is pretty big. But if you got a big butt, it might be a little tight. Nothing wrong with a big butt. All right, I'm gonna save the most exciting thing for last. So I found this hoodie. It was already bleached, which I love, but this is just a North Conway, New Hampshire hoodie. I love North Conway. I've been going to North Conway like my whole life. I go there shopping. I used to stay up there. That's what it looks like. I might keep this for myself, actually. It's just on a Gildan um, sweatshirt and it's a size medium. But yeah, I love you know, the bleached hoodies. I found some Lulu pants. These are the groove pants. I don't know if you'd be able to tell. Oh yeah, you can totally tell. Um, the logo is definitely worn off and there's no size dot or pull tag, but I did measure them and they are probably about a size eight. The waist was 28 and the length 
um, or the inseam was 28 as well, but they're just gray, excellent condition. So these are the, the, the groove pants. So they're wide leg at the bottom. Again, really, really good condition. No pilling on the crotch. You always gotta look at the crotch of Lulu's. Okay, next, I just found this Champion hoodie. It's just a plain white hoodie, size large. Zip up hoodie in really, really good condition for it being white. There's no stains or anything. Got the Champion logo right there. This is um, from Athleta, size medium. It's just a, a gray cowl neck hoodie. Looks like that. This caught my eye because of the colors. So this is actually Hollister. I usually stay away from Hollister clothes. Um, I do pick up like some Hollister jeans, but I stay away from that brand just for the most part. But I don't know, this caught my eye. It's a size medium and it is like a watercolor cold shoulder sweatshirt. I love the colors and it's in excellent condition too. But yeah, cold shoulder, it's kind of cropped. Kind of a little bit. I have measurements in the listing. I don't remember the measurements off the top of my head. But yeah, I just like the colors. So pretty. Okay, I found two of these. These are the North Face Flace. North Face, uh, I think it's called Crescent Hoodie. Uh, size small. They're both size small. Really, really warm. I love the color of this one. Really pink color. And then there's this one, really pretty, like, heathered blue color. They were definitely donated by the same person, I would assume, because they were both next to each other, and they're both the same size, and it's, like, the same style, so... Yeah, this actually sold very quickly. I'm just still gonna show it to you guys. Um, it's a champion uh, quarter zip size medium Looks like that Okay, I found a free people hoodie. Um, I don't know the size. Oh It does say small. Okay. I did list it as a small so it does say small I didn't see the little thing right there, but yeah free people tag right here. It's just a gray lightweight hoodie I found this hoodie. It's a no-name brand, but it just it says Maine on it. I'm from Maine, if you guys didn't know. This is size large. It fits more like a medium, though. I have measurements. Yeah, I like the colors. Fun colors. Okay, a couple more. I found this um, Carhartt uh, sweatshirt jacket thing. It's a size large. And this really pretty olive green color. Really good condition. It says Carhartt. Is it embroidered on the sleeve? I got a bunch of sweatshirts from Pink Victoria's Secret as usual. I'm not going to show you them all because I did get a bunch. Um, but this one I liked because of the color. So this one's got like the intentional raw hem neck. And it's just a long crew neck. Guys, this says extra small on it. No way in hell it's an extra small. No, this is more like a medium. Like it's, it's huge. Maybe even large. I'll have measurements. But yeah, they're sizing. I'll just, I'll never, I'll never get over it. All right, I found this North Face jacket, size medium. Um, I don't know what this is called, but it's like a lightweight fleece jacket. I like the brown and the black. Looks like this. Excellent condition. Another new to me brand. This is cool. That's what the tag looks like. I first heard about this brand from Rally Roots. Um, they sell like cool shorts. My husband sold a couple of cool items before, um, but I don't know. I saw these. I'm like, eh, I'm going to pick them up. These are the Free Flex something pants. Look like this. And they are cropped. They're kind of like a cropped jogger pant, but they're like, I don't know. It's a very lightweight material. This is like an outdoorsy brand. The back looks like that. So we'll see how these do. Not really in season. But we'll see. I found this Adidas jacket. It's a size large. It's just a really, really lightweight jacket. I like how it has the blue cuffs on the sleeves. Looks like that. Full zip in the back. Looks like that. I found another Lulu item. This is the Define jacket. It's a size 8. Um, the color is like a grayish beige color. Looks like that. The back looks like that and this has got the thumb holes with like the fold over cuffs um i remember i found a defined jacket at the bins one time that was like my first ever lou yeah i think it was first or second ever lou lemon fine and it was at the bins it was a black defined jacket and it sold so quick and i should have kept it because that's just like a staple like a Lululemon black defined jacket oh my gosh my battery light's flashing i got one more thing to show you so i found this outdoor voices uh, jacket. Um, this is, oh shit, Mega Fleece, I think it's called. The Mega Fleece. They don't make this kind anymore with the hood. So I was excited to find this. It's a really pretty navy blue color. It's a size extra small, but it's 
it'll definitely fit like a small medium. I have uh, measurements on it. But this is what it looks like. It's like 60 something percent wool. Just a super nice jacket. So yeah, it was ex oops. I was excited to find this brand. Um, I've heard a lot of people talk about it. Comps on this were between like 120 to $150. So we'll see. Um, but yeah, really nice. That is it for my haul video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you see anything that you like, I will have this stuff all listed for sale in my Poshmark closet by the time this video is up. Actually, all of it is listed right now. So if you guys are new to Poshmark and you want to sign up, you can use my code. It is keeping it rad. You get a $10 credit and I also get a $10 credit. So thank you. That's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Bye.